welcome back so in this video we are going to see how to host a website on Amazon s3 bucket we already did everything in the past uh, last video please uh, watch that video for uh, this purpose like how to upload uh, files and all that and how to make it publicly accessible the whole bucket the next we want to uh, I wanted to show you uh, a really cool feature inside your uh, bucket you see it's the same bucket we have the uh, let me show you the object right there if I go to properties now I want to show you where uh, uh, we can turn the whole bucket into a website so this uh, again like in, uh, in the last video I clarified that it's going to be a static website it's not uh, going to be your active website um, so right now it's disable all you have to do is turn add it enable it websites uh, host a static website or redirect request for an object that's uh, like however you want to do it uh, again I've made my file names from uh, here so I'm gonna just copy because you know that that's what my actual file names were I made uh, may I made sure that they were that uh, deliberately so all I have to do next is is to click save changes that's it and now uh, let me go back it's down all the way the last pen now this one is the uh, my website that bucket is actually my web hosting my URL for that website that is going to be hosted on that bucket is this in later down the road uh, when we'll go over DNS the Amazon is uh, DNS is uh, route 53 right uh, here where it is it's it's a route 53 right there so that is the Amazon domain management we're gonna go through that and we'll actually be uh, able to uh, get uh, a custom domain name for example mine is that's my domain name and you can see it's uh, this one we will be able to redirect uh, our domain name and we'll be using the route 53 we'll be able to point it to here and if I click over here you can see now I don't have to go and individually click on that uh, index.html I am on my main page if you remember from the last video and you see even that is working so remember for uh, uh, a domain uh, sorry a website hosting as uh, it's going to be a static it has to be uh, on a uh, bucket that you have made publicly accessible by using the that uh, little JSON script that we ran and you have to go and uh, enable these uh, static website hosting feature inside that bucket's property these are the three things that you have to do in order for you to host a web static website hosting or uh, in in on a s3 bucket uh, hopefully this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one